It's our last morning on the Missouri here. And we're walking into a different location than we fished the past two days. It's really some beautiful scenery, almost like we're in a canyon here. And uh, supposedly there's supposed to be some nice fish, so we'll see what we can hook into. Dad just hooked up with a good one. You gotta look at it yet, Dad. <laughs> I don't know if he wants to try and go up and over the dam or what. Probably. I have that here. You never know in case it comes out of work. I think it's on something smaller. Man, that's nerve wracking. Yeah. Look at that canyon background. There we go. How's the lighting, Doug? Fantastic. Good, so if he catches it. I'm oh man. Did you get a look at it, Dad? And he got off. That seems to be the hookup ratio is 50 50. Now we've each hooked into a fish, and Wait, you hooked one too, don't none you? of us have landed it. I hooked one on a dry a little bit earlier. Just kind of jug it. What do you think it was on, Dad? before lunch here. Uh, fishing's been slow, but the scenery is absolutely fantastic. So we're just kicking back, enjoying the view, and hopefully gonna be getting into some fish here after we eat. What's on the menu? Peanuts, nut raisin mix, and Multi-grain, this is like literally, this might be my favorite thing in an MRE. Multi-grain snack bread. It is so good. Peanut butter, strawberry jam. Don't put that pressure on me. What are they, 20? Yeah. I can try and add them for you, Dad. Give me one second. Holy shower, Matt. Oh my gosh. Tell me what to do, Dad. Dad with a fish? Dan's gonna try and help him net it. Okay. Alright, Dad has a second one here. We just landed his first. Dad just landed his first fish here. And boy, to put up a fight, we are down river, so we had to run up. Now he's hooked into his second. And also, again, putting up a good fight. These fish are massive. The nymphing really turned on here in the afternoon. It hadn't been hadn't been doing much, and actually I'd been having more luck on dry flies, but now looks like it's getting a little better. Let me get a picture here. All right, Dad with another one. Dan again is the neck guy, which is the worst job. Very stressful.
Let's see if we can see the fish. All right, guys. Well, that is uh, that's gonna bring a wrap to the Montana trip, and uh, I'm sure I speak for Dad and for Doug. This has been one of the best trips I've ever taken in my life. It was just memorable, and I'm sure there will be many trips like this in the future. And we're excited to share them with you guys. So if you guys like the, this video, if you guys want to see more Montana, then make sure you give us a thumbs up. And make sure you guys subscribe because we will be posting content like this in the future. Our cousin Nick is going to be moving out here. So we're going to be out here for at least the next couple of years every single summer. It's going to be great. But again, this trip is one for the books. One that I will never forget. So thanks for watching this episode and all these episodes from Montana on Backyard Angling. We'll see you guys on the water.